What's up, YouTube? It's your boy John from Project Ellsworth. Over the last week or so, I went to a couple different Best Buys and I got something in the mail from Amazon. This one's short but sweet. Guess we'll call this quality over quantity. This is another horror merch haul. My eye has been bugging the crap out of me all morning. You too, huh? What's up, YouTube? As always, I hope everybody out there is doing well and staying safe. All right, so the first thing that I got I will go over is what I received in the mail from Amazon. I've been looking for this thing. I would say I've jumped into a Best Buy location three or four times over the last few weeks trying to get my hands on this thing, and that is the new Friday the 13th Part 3 Steelbook. I've been looking, looking for this thing everywhere, haven't been able to find it. I, I've, I've mentioned so many times in videos, the, the, my, my box set from Shop Factory is right there. They've now started releasing all these in steel books. I'm definitely going to buy them all in steel books because that's the, the, the neurotic completist that I am. Now they're getting ready to start releasing them in 4K. It's quite ridiculous, to be honest with you. But I'm sure that I'm not alone in that I will buy pretty much every Friday the 13th release they put out. Uh, I said in my last video that I really think that we need to somehow figure out a way to put our foot down, <laughs> but that ain't happening. We're just buying these things. All right. And another, uh, well, now we'll move on to Best Buy. I went into Best Buy looking for that and they didn't have it. I was in there looking for that and I was in there looking for the 4K of the Northman. And they didn't have that either, but I did finally get my hands on the 4K of John Carpenter's Escape from New York. I looked for this last week or the week before, whatever my last haul video was. This is one of the ones I was looking for and they didn't have it. Glad to get this uh, get this in my hands. I also had this previously. I had, Of course I did. I had the standard definition DVD of this. I've never had it on Blu-ray, but I skipped right over the Blu-ray and got the 4K. This actually has Blu-ray in it. So now I have all of it. DVD, Blu-ray, 4K, good stuff. No digital copy. Who gives a shit? All right, so I got that. And while I was in that store, I also found, I definitely opened a Pandora's box here. I got this Predator figure. This one is the Fugitive Predator. That's a totally different video. The Fugitive Predator. I think this is either my sixth or my seventh Predator figure now. I looked online one time. Man, I am short looking today. I looked online when I was re rearranging my NECA shelf earlier this year or late last year, whatever it was, doesn't matter. And I saw that there are around 90 to 100 Predator figures. And I was like, well, that's ridiculous. Well, now I've started buying them, which is even more ridiculous because I literally have nowhere to put 100 Predator figures. That's just stupid. And I know that at some point I just got to go, you know what? I'll probably get to like 30 and then decide, well, now I'm at 30, so I got to get 50. It's it's so ridiculous. But he's actually really cool. If he wasn't as cool looking as he is, I probably wouldn't have bought him. You probably get a better look at him there than you will here because of the glare and the reflection and all that happy shit. But he was pretty awesome. And like I said, he's either my sixth or my seventh Predator figure. Who knows? I should really do myself a favor and not count. But I know that that's not going to happen either. So I went into Best Buy several times, couldn't find this, ordered it on Amazon. Went in there that day looking for the Northman, couldn't find it. So then after that, I went to Target looking for the Northman. Best Buy had the Northman. They had one copy in the store and they had a Blu-ray. Then I went right in the same parking lot, ran over to Target looking for it. And the only thing that they had in the store was literally one 
DVD, and there wasn't even a section on the shelf for a 4K. So I went, I left there empty-handed and kind of pissed because it, it was the day that it came out. I'm telling you, physical media is not even getting put on. Not only is it hard to find now, it isn't even getting put on the on the damn shelf the day it comes out anymore. So new release day, I'm starting to look at it like the following week is like the seven day to seven to ten old seven to ten day new release. It's it's crazy. But a couple days after that, my wife was in Vineland, New Jersey, eating lunch at a Chick Fil A, and realized, hey, there's a Best Buy in this parking lot. So she contacted me and said, look on their website and see if they had the Northman, and as luck would have it, they had one copy of the Northman in 4K in that store. So, I finally got the, my hands on this thing a couple days later, well, better late than never, and I planned on watching this thing on Sunday, and or excuse me, on Friday, and that never happened because my son had a friend come over, and that canceled all those plans. So I still haven't had a chance to watch this. But it does look really good. This is obviously non-horror. It's an A24 film, if I'm not mistaken. I think it is. I thought it was. Whatever. Whatever. But, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing this thing. This looks really, really good. And it's not the typical movie that I buy. But very interested. So, all in all, like I said, quality over quantity. I got three really cool DVDs, Blu-rays, 4Ks, and another predator figure whatever man i'm happy my shelves are even more happy i don't know i'm i gotta figure this thing out i'm just gonna have to like buy i just bought these neca shelves like less than a year ago maybe around a year ago slightly more than a year ago and it's so full that i don't have anywhere to put stuff i have a pile on the floor i think i'm gonna do something over here uh and if i do i'm sure you guys will see it i'm gonna get out of here now i'm babbling whatever. If you guys like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you really like this video and you've been enjoying my content up to this point, please do me a huge personal favor. Click that subscribe button and ring that bell. Take care of yourself. Take care of each other. Have a kick-ass day. Thank you for watching, folks. Later.